question. Hi friends. I wanted to come and read this book to you today. Whoopsies, pardon me. And I wanted to come to the water again. I also wanted you to notice that there's boats out in the water because it is opening day fishing this week. I brought my son with me. Joey, can you say hi? Hi. Can you look, look up? He's wearing his baseball uniform. Just for fun. There he is. Okay, so let's go ahead and begin. Lemu the Blue Turtle. Every year, thousands of baby turtles climb out of their sandy nests and make their way to the ocean. here. <laughs> this year out popped another baby turtle, but this one was blue. The tiny blue turtle opened its big eyes, shook the sand off its head, and started to make its way to the ocean. When all of the other turtles saw the blue turtle, they started to laugh. They pointed their flippers at the poor turtle and teased him. No one likes me, said the blue turtle. He dunked his head under the surf and rowed out to the sea. Growing up in the sea, Limu, the blue turtle, would meet other turtles. But after looking at Limu, the other turtles would laugh and swim away. No one wants to be my friend, Limu said. So these guys, the ones that are laughing, they're giving cold pricklies, aren't they? Okay, but growing up was not all bad. Limu would body surf in the big waves and he would chase colorful fishes into the coral. One day, when he was eating his favorite seaweed off some rocks, he heard someone crying. When Lumu looked up, he saw a little opihi. Why are you crying? asked Lumu. I am so sad. I miss my sister who lives far away, cried the little opihi. I can take you, said the blue turtle. I can swim really fast and we will be there in no time. You are such a nice turtle, said the Opihi. My name is Nani. My name is Limu. Hop on my back. The Opihi jumped on Limu's back. She hung, she hung on tight as the blue turtle swam under the water. They swam near the surface and they swam in the deep part of the water. They laughed with all the family of seals playing in the water as well. All of a sudden, the water became black. Nani was very scared. What is it, Limu? She cried. When Limu looked up, he saw that he was, he had bumped into a big whale. The whale was crying. What's wrong? Limu asked. I was swimming in the deep water near a sunken ship and I got a big piece of wood stuck in my flipper. The whale cried. It hurt so much. Maybe I can help, said Limu. Limu bit onto the piece of wood and pulled with all his might. He pulled and he pulled and he pulled. You can do it, yelled Nani. Suddenly, plop, the wood came out. How can I ever thank you, asked the whale. My flipper is as good as new. Glad I could help. My name is Limu, the blue turtle said. My name is Jonah, replied the whale. You are a good-hearted turtle, Limu. Thanks again. After a day of traveling, the blue turtle and the little opihi could see the beautiful day where Nani's sister lived. Many different kinds of colorful fish lived in the reef. Reef, pardon me. Limu looked at all of the different types of seaweed. There was so much food to eat 
There's my sister's home, Nani said. I'm so happy. How can I ever thank you, Limu? I am happy that I could help, said Limu. Look at all the colorful fish and the reef with all the coral and the seagrass. They pulled closer to the water's edge where Nani's sister lived. Nani let out a big yell. Who, Lani? Lani saw Nani and cried tears of joy for she was happy to see her sister too. Nani jumped off Limu's back and hugged her sister. Oh. Thank you so much, Limu, said Lani. You are a great friend to my sister and me. I am so glad to see Nani. You have a big heart. Then she told Limu, please eat some seaweed. Limu ate and ate. He never had seen so many different types of seaweed. He was so busy eating that he did not see how far he had drifted from the rocky shore. And all of a sudden, he saw two beady eyes. Oh. Those beady eyes were looking at him. What do you think it is? <gasps> and there's more. Then he saw a lot of beady eyes and big dark shapes and Lima became very afraid. You look good, good enough to eat, said one of the dark shapes. When it moved closer, Lima saw that it was a shark. You will make a delicious lunch, said another shark. We have never eaten a blue turtle before. Just then, a big black shadow covered Limu. The big black shadow started to flip the sharks high, in, high into the sky, one by one. The other sharks were afraid and swam away as fast as they could. It looked like you needed some help, Limu, said the whale. Oh, thank you, Jonah, said Limu. You saved my life. Well, that's what friends are for. See you later, Limu, said the whale as he swam away. Limu swam back to Lani's home. He was so happy because he was in a beautiful place with his friends. And he knew that no matter what he looked like on the outside, others liked him because of the good turtle he was on the inside. Isn't that a nice story? Thank you for reading with me today, friends. That was Limu, the big, the blue turtle.